Good evening, everybody. Your host, AMF1534, here. Let's play some more Bioshock. I don't know why I did that. I just really, really wanted to do that. To me, it sounded like it was scary, but to the rest of you, you're probably like, God, that guy sounds like a fucking child molester. I'm watching a Let's Play of a child molester. That's just fucking grand now, isn't it? Yeah, that's, that's how that was, but... <laughs> I don't know. I thought it was kind of cool. I've been waiting to do that. For whatever reason, it just sounded like a great idea. I can hack that safe. Cool! No, now why would they be interested in something useful? They're never interested in anything that's useful. What, is, what does this say? The Rapture Open. That sounds like a great event. Score an ace for Dental Hygiene. Because they spelled Dental Hygiene wrong. Sponsored by Telekinesis. Oh no! Is, are we going to get a new Plasmid? Yes, we are! So sick. New Plasmid, Telekinesis. Pick up big stuff with your mind. Throw them at your enemies. What else do you need to know? Oh, I'm so excited right now. You've run out of slots and we'll have to replace a Plasmid. Aw, oh, shitty. I, mean, I, don't feel like, I don't feel like getting rid of the Electro Bolt would be a very good idea, so I guess I have to get rid of this. That sucks, man. I just got used to liking that thing. Catch grenades and throw them back. <laughs> That's so awesome. Don't you be throwing bottles at me, bitch. I'm gonna put one right upside your forehead. This is so sick. Let's see what this is all about. Oh, that's so awesome. Damn, and apparently we can throw them with... Oh. I didn't realize that there was stuff there. There's stuff hanging off of that one, too. What other things are being hidden around here? Huh. What is this? Well, that tennis ball is all over the place. Oh, an Eve hypo. I don't need it, but... Oh, what's up, bitch? Would you like a trophy? To the face? I'm gonna fall in love with this thing so quickly. I mean, I didn't realize that it was gonna have so much destructive force, but hey, I'm, I'm not gonna argue with it whatsoever. So we're still trying to find the office of Dr. Steinman. I feel like when we find Dr. Steinman, all hell's going to break loose, and I still feel really bad for that person. Now, I guess playing Team Fortress too. I've actually never played Team Fortress before, and I'm probably gonna get, you know, a comment from somebody being like, blah, 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 blah. You've never played that before. What the fuck is your problem? Well, you know, I just never played it. Oh, no! No, not the rocket thing again. I'm going to disable you. Yes, I'm going to sway you in my direction. Why? Because I can. It's that thing up there. Yeah, I feel like, um... I know that in this room that we're in right now, we have to find the key uh, to get into that particular area, and I have a pretty, pretty strong feeling right in the pit of my penis that uh, Dr. Steinman probably has that key. So upon which, we need to find a way to get that. We gotta find him first, and I know, I mean, I, I have a pretty good feeling of where he is. I got that funny little feeling, I remember that being a song actually. Um, we need to go into uh, that area that we haven't gone into yet, which pretty broad. And I gotta go into that room we haven't been in before, and I'm sure that's probably where he's gonna be. Well, I will auto-hack that one, too. I, I don't really feel like, uh, you know, cracking all the saves. I mean, I did just get a bunch of different, uh... Oh, shit. I did just get a whole bunch of different, um... You know, cool items last time that make my hacking abilities much better and make everything a lot easier, but... That doesn't necessarily mean that I want to hack a whole bunch more when I don't necessarily have to. I know that at the end of my last episode too, somebody said that I missed a, uh, they said that I missed a safe back somewhere, but I, and I, I know where that room is, but I don't really want to go all the way back there to do it. What is this? The wrench jockey? Whatever's going on in this dialogue is going to be pretty ugly, it looks like. Wrench Jockey bulks up your upper body, allowing you to wield club-like weapons with extreme force. Well, we'll give that a test. I wonder if there's going to be somebody out here. Seems like every time I pick up something like this, they give you the opportunity to test it out. And it does not fail. Exactly how strong is this going to be? Yeah! Oh, man. 
I did not expect it to be that strong. I expected it to maybe, maybe like, I don't know, maybe two swings and you were dead, but once again, for the second time this episode, I have been pleasantly surprised. Okay, well now, we're off to see the wizard, the wonderful wizard of Oz. And by that, I mean this guy. Actually, these guys, the guys that throw these things, I can use my telekinesis. Yeah! I had a feeling that was going to work out. As soon as I said that you could grab things and throw them at people, I had a feeling that was that was just going to be what you're going to be able to do. I'm surprised that he's actually in one piece after that. I mean, I would have... I would have been blown to bits. Andrew Ryan asks you a oh, I know where it is. That safe is in here. I will definitely go in here, just because I know that it is now here. But where was that safe? Where? Where? I think it's actually right here. Yes, thank you for $64 buyout? Jesus Christ. That is expensive. Then again, I guess it is a safe and it does hold a lot of good things. So we'll do this, we'll make it come down this way, and then we'll make it come down this way, over there. Oh, I need one more straight guy. Give me a straight guy! No gaze. There we go. Awesome! What could possibly be in here? More more ammo. A I love getting all this ammo. Especially because I feel like as soon as we find Dr. Steinman, we're going to erupt in one very ugly, ugly confrontation that's going to involve lots of bullets and lots of... Particularly unnecessary bloodshed, but I'm going to love it all the same. Oh boy, here we go. Here we go. Oh, bring it on! Okay, maybe you don't bring it on then. Aha! Uh -huh. We are gonna bring it on! Again! Like the really shitty movie. Does anybody find it weird that I've actually watched, um, two out of the whatever bring it on movies that they had not like I have like this fascination with cheerleading or anything but the girls were attractive oh god oh man that, that kind of creeped me out there for a minute I was like oh no not these guys but then I realized I'm definitely separated by a tunnel and a giant thing of water so I guess I'm not in any sort of real danger here aesthetics are a moral imperative no doctor Steinman, you are a moral imperative, you dick. Two eyes. There's a law that says we must to arms, to legs, to ears, to press. Two dicks. What? No, who said that? There you are. What? Wait a minute! He should be dead! His life bar was at zero! You cheating bastards! Of course. Is that like a glitch? Like, was that supposed to happen? Was he supposed to be able to get out of that alive? Like, did they not think about the possibility of that happening? Come here. Yeah, you are dead. No, you're not. Maybe you are now. Yeah, there we go. Now he's dead. So, I got a weird feeling. A weird, weird feeling. Let me actually look in here. Yeah. Might as well, I figure, you know, if, this, if we're going to be having one of those, you know, good old-fashioned brouhaha's here with, with Dr. Steinman being that guy, then I'm probably going to want to stock up on some ammo here. But uh, I feel like if they wanted us to find, um, if they wanted us to find, or come in here first, I feel like they wanted me to come in here first, and then find out that I had to go find the telekinesis plasmid, and then go back down there and find it. So I feel like, I feel like I got this item out of order. But I'm not, I'm not upset with it. Then again, I'm, I don't know. For those playing this for the first time, I guess they would bank on you wanting to explore everywhere before you go anywhere else new. Oh, he's probably talking about um, fucking Andrew Ryan's wife. Because I remember they were kind of they were kind of chilling and doing some weird bullshit. There was some some uh, Doug funny business going on there. Oh boy. Oh, him to bits, he says! Hey, Dr. Steinman, did you ever think of the idea that maybe I know how to hack electronic devices and turn them in my favor? But you didn't think of that now, did you? I'll buy it out. I don't really feel like hacking that thing right now. I just want to... I just want to get down to the nitty-gritty. Yes. Yes! I'll do this one, too! 
No. What the fuck's going on? What are you shooting at? Um, apparently this thing is immune to things. Oh no, I didn't blow it up. Ah! There we go. Did not think I was gonna- I thought I could just, you know, disable it momentarily and it would be all- all good. But apparently not. Can I hack it? Yes, I can. And I can buy it out, too. And that'll be just fine. I'm kind of in like this buy this buyout mode right now. I think it's just because I want to I want to get to Doctor Steinman as quickly as possible. I feel like I'm just you know I'm I'm all giddy like a little schoolgirl or something about this. Shit, shit, shit! No, I definitely fucked it up. I really did. I really did it. Well, I think that's like the first. That's not the first time that I've done that now, isn't it? Shit, shit! Come on, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Hurry up, gotta find the right one. Gotta find the right one. Where is it? There it is. And then I gotta find another one. Where is that one? Did I not just do the same puzzle? I feel like I just did this puzzle just a minute ago. I think that's exactly what happened. There we go. It's like that commercial. My dog's name is Wego. You've gotta be kidding. Really? Try it. Here we go. Then he goes and gets all the beer. I actually would, wouldn't mind having a pet just so I could name him Wego. So, I could do that kind of thing. Who is Aphrodite? I really want to know this. Oh, so this is the girl he's talking about. I was kind of curious. Yikes, that's... Very, very morose. Oh boy, the viewing rooms. This ought to be great. I am so excited for this. Oh boy. Well, might as well get the big gun out now. Not that one, but this one. Get yourself all reloaded and ready to go. Hey, you fucking Nazi, how are you? What can I do with this one, Aphrodite? She won't stay still! God, that person was still alive. That's the only other alive, normal-looking human being that I've seen in a while. How did his lights turn on by themselves? Did he? Was he like waiting for me to come in to do that? He's ugly, ugly, ugly. Yes, all the normal doctors always have a Tommy gun right next to their workstation. That sounds pretty normal. Hey, you can take incredibly large amounts of damage. Holy shit. Where do you think you're going? You come back here. That's a health station. Well, fuck, I don't want him to use it. Yeah, you're not going to use this health station, sir. I'm going to buy it out so you can't use it. Because now you're going to take damage whenever you try to come over here. So, fuck off. I don't know where you think you're going. Where did you go? You had to have gone somewhere. Oh, I think I saw ya. Where did you go, Dr. Steinman? I just want to talk with you and... Yeah. And get that key right off of your dead, rotting corpse. Ah, uh, you're too busy working on my turret over there to realize that I'm behind you shooting the shit out of you. Hey, Doctor. Come here! Ah, uh, you can't use it. Ha 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 ha! Steinman's dead! And we won our first, our little first boss battle there. Yeah, there's that emergency access key. You alright? Yes, I am. It was time somebody took care of that sick bastard. And I did. Make sure you get the key off Steinman. And head back to emergency access. I'm working my way to the back side of the port net to myself. We'll get there soon enough. Okay. I can't wait. I'm actually, like, excited to meet this guy, as strange as that sounds. I feel like... It kind of reminds me of, like, a, like the Penumbra games, where, you're, you know, you're talking to the guy with the, you know, with the CB radio pretty much the entire game, and you don't actually end up meeting him until, like, the very last moment. And then when you finally meet him, you're like, holy shit. Even though, actually, in Penumbra, you never actually met the guy. Like, face to face. I mean, you were in the same room as him once, but you ended up having to... No, 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 no. I'm not going to spoil it. I'm not going to spoil it. 
Okay, well now that we, uh, actually I'm gonna go search this corpse here. Good old... Ooh. It sounds like Dr. Steinman, or Steinman, really, uh, really had a little bit of a fetish with, uh, no, don't do that. I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear it. I really don't. Shut up. How do you make these things go away? Like, when you don't want to hear them anymore. I don't know how to do that. Well, amidst all this talking, now that we have this awesome key, now we get to go use it. I think that that's probably the key that's all the way back, oh. You guys want some of this now, don't you? Oh, I have electric buckshot! <laughs> I didn't realize I had that equipped. Well, that was exciting. Whoa! Hey, what's up? No, I don't want to deal with all this crap. What do you what do you guys want? Get the hell out of here. Apparently. Where, the, where did you come from? Are you like spawning people or is that what's going on or what? I don't really know what the purpose of that guy is, but I don't know if I like it. Okay, well now that we uh, now that we got the key, we're gonna go use the key and see where inevitably it's going to take us. I'm kind of excited about it, but uh, this is your host AMF fifteen thirty four saying thank you guys for watching and watching me kill Doctor Steinman. Our first boss battle's out of the way, and I have a feeling they're all gonna get vastly more difficult from there. So uh, yeah, we'll we'll, uh, we'll have some fun next time. You guys take care, okay? Bye.